Oil sands, or as it has been dubbed by some, tar sands, refers to the mixture of sand, clay, and water that contains naturally occurring extra heavy crude oil known as bitumen. Bitumen is highly viscous, meaning it does not flow unless it is heated or mixed with lighter hydrocarbons. Think of it like cold molasses. Conventional drilling techniques cannot be used on bitumen because it is too viscous to flow and sticks to the sand grains in which it was found. Therefore, other extraction techniques were developed to produce the oil, the most common methods being open pit mining and in situ, which is Latin for in place. Bitumen within 75 meters of the surface is open pit mined. First, huge clumps of oil sands are shoveled into large trucks. They are then taken to crushers, where they are broken down and mixed with heated water to separate the bitumen from the sand. Once the bitumen is released, it is sent for further processing. Around 80% of the oil sands are found 75 meters below the surface, and to extract them, in situ or underground methods must be used. The majority of the in-situ operations pump steam underground through horizontal wells with the purpose of liquefying the bitumen, which can then be pumped up to the surface, a method called steam-assisted gravity drainage. Produced bitumen is heavier than conventional sources and requires a special process called upgrading to give it properties similar to conventional oil. Once processed, bitumen is refined just like conventional oil into common petroleum products. The two largest oil sands reserves in the world are located in northern Alberta, Canada, and Venezuela. The oil sands represent a large supply of potentially recoverable oil, and like all oil, its key advantage is its energy density. It is a versatile transportation fuel and is used in the creation of petroleum-based products that we use every day, like plastics. Oil sands development poses environmental and social challenges. The crude derived from oil sands is more carbon intensive than conventional crude. This is due to the greenhouse gas emissions associated with the production techniques used in the oil sands. Other environmental challenges include heavy water use, which in most cases comes from fresh water sources. Tailings ponds, which are man-made dams for storing wastewater from oil sands mining processes, are problematic because of the contaminants contained in the wastewater. The water cannot be naturally recycled back into the ecosystem, but many companies are exploring technologies to return the water and ponds to their natural states. Land disturbance and use is also a concern for the oil sands, particularly when it comes to mining, as deposits occur in ecologically diverse areas. Finally, oil sands production costs are higher than conventional sources of oil. That's oil sands.